Hello, boys and girls. Now it's time to learn about the theoretical aspects of Bow Wow Wow. Let's learn about the theory that makes the song. Okay, so let's take a pen here and let's identify a few things, okay? Well, right here is the treble. treble. Clef. Oh, it's hard to write with this. Treble clef. Clef. Treble clef. And what's the other name for treble clef? G the clef. G clef. And you're thinking, oh my, why, why? Why is it called the G clef? Well, because this little line, this circle part of the treble clef identifies the note on this line as G. G. So that would be G. The G, G line. G here. Okay. So there we go. So now we just identified the G, G clef. clef. Or the treble clef. Treble okay, clef. All right, boys and girls. Now let's clear that away. And now, oh my goodness, let's get another color here. Here is the key signature. And we have two sharps in the key signature. Two sharps. The key signature. And the sharps tell us to raise the pitch a half step. Do, re, mi. Do, re, mi. Okay, so but we have two sharps in the key signature. Me would be an key F signature. natural. Key, sig. Me was sig. the F sharp. Na, sure. All right, so we learned about the G clef or treble clef, and we learned about the key signature. Oh, and by the way, this note is a D. The beginning note is a D, and that tells us we're in the key of D. Okay, let's clear that away. Now, here's something you really need to know. The time signature. Time. Signature. Big. Na. Sure. The time signature. Sig. Na. This is an N right here. You can see that. Signature. This is an A. Hmm. Ooh, let's put the E here. Time signature. Well, let's go ahead and clear that. And what's another name for time signature? Meter signature. What's another name for time signature? Meter signature. Meter signature. Because it measures. So we have meter. Or we have another name is time. Signature. Sig. Na. Sure. That's a little, little clearer, right? OK, so meter or time signature. And there's a two on the top. So the two tells us that we get two beats in each measure. And the quarter note that is down here at the bottom, and the quarter note tells us the quarter note gets the beat. So what note gets the beat? The quarter note. The quarter note. So here's a quarter note. Here's a quarter note. 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 And quarter note. Now, so let's write that up there. Quarter. So it's like a quarter. The coin. The quarter. Quarter. No. Let's figure that away. What two notes equal one quarter note? Two well, eighth notes. Two. Eighth notes being together. These two eighth notes being together equal a quarter note. Okay? So there we go. Now let's go back and count the beats in the measure. Mm -hmm. Let's clear that. Let's count the beats. One, two, 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 one, two. One, two. So each measure has two beats in it. Why? Because in the time signature, the two is at the top. And what note gets the beat? The quarter the note. Quarter note, because the quarter note's at the bottom of the meter or time signature. And what two notes equal a quarter note? Two eighths two notes. Eighth notes equal the quarter note. It's not very nice notes. It should be a nice oval, something like that. OK, so that's how the time signature measures the time, or the meter signature measures the time of the beats and the notes in the song, the rhythms in the song. OK, now let's get back to clear that away. So what divides notes into measures? What divides notes into measures? Bar lines. What divides the sounds into measures? What's a measure? Well, here's a bar line, 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 and a double bar line. And the bar line divides the notes into measures. Into measures. Just like you measure with a yardstick or a ruler. Meh. Sure. Bar lines divide the notes the into measures. Point. The measures. beats into measures. Okay, let's count the, the measures. Hmm. All right, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. How many measures do we have? 
we have eight measures. Eight measures. How many beats in this song, Bow Wow Wow? How many beats? Mm. Hmm. Well, we have eight measures. And how many beats are in each measure? Two. Two. So what's eight times two? Sixteen. I think. I'm pretty sure eight times two. Eight, sixteen. It's a sixteen. We have sixteen beats in this song. Sixteen beats. Wow. How neat is that? Okay. So that's how the time signature, what's the other name for time signature? Is meter signature. Okay. Now, of course, we've already done the key signature and we identified the treble clef. What's the other name for treble clef? G clef. Right. Okay. Now let's clear that out of the way. I spy a DO right here. I spy that. That means I see it. Do. And the DO is not do. Not in this case, it's do. And let's just use a, well, I'll write out the first one. This is going to be do. And if this note is do, then what is this note here going to be? Do. That's going to be do as well. Do, do, do. And then do, re, mi. So if this note here would no, be No, that me, note is re. This note here has to be me. And it's an Italian syllable, so we're going to spell it with an I. Me, 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 me. Mm -hmm. And now, this note would be fa. So this note here is going to be so. So. I'll just abbreviate with that. So, so. And this note here is la. La. Mi, so, mi, do, mi, re, do. So if I do my hand signs, do, 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 mi, 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 so, 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 la, so, mi, do, mi, re, do. Now, how do you know how to sing that rhythm? Oh, my goodness. Well, let's review our notes, okay? Let's pick um, orange. Well, this is a quarter note. Quarter note, quarter note, cue for quarter note. And what do we say for quarter note? Well, let's come back to that. Here's quarter note. Q for quarter note. Here's quarter note. And here's quarter note. And these here are quarter notes. Quarter, Q for quarter, and quarter. Okay. So one, two, one. <gasps> what is this? Quarter What's rest. This is a quarter rest. It lasts for the same amount of time as the quarter note. One, two, three. <gasps> Notice I took a breath on the quarter rest. There's a quarter rest. Let's do Q. R for quarter rest. And then we only have one more here, quarter rest. Quarter rest. Okay. Oh my. What are these notes here? What are these two notes? Two eighth well, notes beamed together. Two eighth notes beamed together. E, I, G, T, H. Two eighth notes. And then what do we say for the eighth notes? Well, T, we're come back to that. Eighth notes. Eighth notes. Eighth note. Two eighth notes beamed together with the beam. Two eighth notes beam together. Okay. Well, let's clear that away. Now, what do we say for the eighth, the quarter note? What do we say for the quarter note? Ta. We say ta. Ta. And I'll abbreviate ta. Ta. And what do we say for the quarter rest? Nothing. It's just ta, ta, ta. Ta. What do we say for the two eighth notes? T, T. We say T. T. Ta, ta, ta. Ta, T, T, Ta. We know that that's me, so we're going to sing it on that pitch. And then, hmm, let's find the orange again. T, 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 of course. T, T. And then this would be Ta, Ta. Ta, Ta, Ta. Now, some teachers, they don't teach the real name of the notes, but I do. I think it's important. Even this eight-measure song has so much theory to teach. It's not only a fun dance circle game movement activity, but it's a, a wonderful song to learn about music theory. So let's try this here. Um, ta, 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 ti, ti, ta, ti, 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 ta, 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 ta. And let's just see here. Ta, 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 ti, ti, ta, ti, 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 ta, 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 ta. Okay. Well, there you go, boys and girls. That is a lot of theory. All right, I hope you hung in there with this whole theoretical music theory video. And thank you so much, everybody. Okay, bye.